Right, so number 29, you can see I've been able to use one that we used uh, originally. You can see I've still got some of the lime stains on it. You can see where get up so we're on the line for our gauge mark there and obviously nice one and a half millimeter joint so when I'm doing this one for you here obviously I'm going to need a closure header closure and a header so at the moment again I'm trying to use um, the ones that we had before so the way I'm rubbing these is I get my template number 29 right right inside I put it there and then I use my sand and block uh, I've got the smooth side and the rough side so if I've got a, a load to take off obviously I'll use that and if I'm getting to like uh, like I'm there just about there I'll just turn on to this uh, the smooth side so what I do is just rub to until I get down to my template and then I'll move it to the other end and you can just see there I'm just a little bit high there so what I'm gonna do is use this the coarse side just rub this until I'm on there and then once both ends are right, I then rub it and keep checking with the square to make sure they're right there. But you can just see here, I've just got a little bit of daylight on top of my template there. So I'm not going to rub that one down. And then I'm going to fake in a perp and a perp there just to get two closures in the header. And then I'll have to uh, cut and rub myself the end header after I've done this one so just faked in these two joints uh, just uh, make it look like I've got two closures there I've just rubbed this one independently and again just to recap I kept that on the end and I rubbed to that rubbed to the top as well and then obviously using straightness I just uh, did that and we'll just see there that I could do got a bit of daylight there just still just need to rub down where my thumb is just to get that down so I'm just going to rub that down before I take it over so just rub them down so they're a little bit smoothing out I just got just a fraction of light there but that's less than sort of like uh, half a mil so I'm well happy with that I just do a, a double check on the face paint as well which I'm really happy with so just get the dust off so it is over to the arch you see as we said before We've got the pencil mark as a guideline. It fits on there really well. And the back header goes in. You can see these ones have been laid before because of the lime on them, but always good to reuse. So I'll just double check by putting straight edge through there. And then when I'm happy with that, Go. So I am pretty happy with that. So now I will go on to day. So just six more to do to get to the crown. I basically caught up with Dutchy. Um, that's how I was off on Thursday with a broken down vehicle so Dutchy steamed ahead of me so I've just come in on Saturday morning to catch up so looking forward to this have a tidy up and get them